Hi guys, what if I told you that your prayers are like a bank account? In that, you can store them up. Welcome back guys to IMFL. Now prayer is a communication between ourselves and God. And sometimes in terms of the answer to our prayer, it can either be a yes or a no or a wait. Now when we get a wait response on our prayer, that's when the bank account principle applies. Just as much as we have to save and watch our money grow, that's how it works when it comes to prayers. We have to keep praying and those prayers don't go to waste. They get stored up. For the time in which God deems is right, he then releases the answer to that prayer, a yes or a no. So it's really, really important that we keep praying, particularly when things are rosy in our lives, because we find that we tend to go to God in prayer when things are really tough, when we're struggling with something, when we need answers, when we're financially down. But that shouldn't be the case. We should swap it around rather and pray when things are rosy. So when we're happy, when we're joyful, when things are going really well in our lives, in our marriages, our children are healthy, that's when we need to start praying and store up those prayers. What would I do if I had a million pounds? I'd probably just walk up to the cash machine every now and again, put my card in the machine, type in my pin, look at the bank balance and smile because I can do that. I've watched my money grow. Likewise, we need to be able to keep praying. And as we keep praying, that prayer gets put into a savings account. And as it keeps growing, it gets to a point where that prayer is answered and we can look back and smile because we've put the effort in to grow those prayers. So that's just where I want to lead today's one. Remember, Keep praying because you're putting your prayers into a savings account and it will come back to you and it will reward you. I'll catch you again next Sunday. Don't forget to subscribe, comment or like. Take care.